In today's cup shoe review, I'm going to be sharing with you guys a few really amazing pieces. Um, one that I think would look amazing on every single body type. And also a few little fails. Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. Welcome if you're new. Hello, hi, I'm Katie and welcome back if you're a channel subscriber. You're the best. If you are new here and you enjoyed today's video, please remember to hit that red button, subscribe for all those good vibes and join our Good Vibe Tribe. Join me over on Instagram as well for some body confidence and body love, as well as some daily fashion. I'm at with love Katie and two underscores. And in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you my honest review of some cup she swimwear pieces. Um, so there's one I think which is gonna be super flattering on all body shapes but then there are a few which I don't really know who they're gonna suit. And I don't know how the model made them look like that and I just don't even know how that happened. But I also have a discount code if any of you guys love any of the pieces, then I'll leave it here on the screen right now and everything will be linked down below in the description box. Okay, so there was a little bit of mix up with some of the bikinis. Um, I told Kapshi that I was a UK size 12 and they sent me size smalls. In what world is a size 12 size small? Um, I think the most comfiest size for me would have been a large. However, I've ended up with a medium. So we're gonna go with it, we're gonna roll with it, but I would recommend any size 12 girls go for the size large, UK 12 that is. And just for reference, because you guys seem to always ask, I'm five foot 10. So all of these bikinis range from about 20 pound to maybe 35 pound max, so they're very, you know, average middle of the road price. Quality is fairly good, so I will just talk you through each one. Okay, so this first one is super cute. I absolutely love the frills. You guys know I love a frill. I think it's really, really pretty. Unfortunately, however, this is just super tiny. Like in what world? In what world is that gonna be going over my boobies? It's tiny. It's literally minuscule. And because I've seen the size small, I feel like there's barely any difference. So I'm hoping that if you went up to a large, you would see the difference. Obviously the fit around can be adjusted because of the tie back strap, which I do think looks great on. It is just a little bit small, which is just such a shame because it is so pretty. It's got removable cups. I probably would take the cups out if I'm honest, um, because you can sort of see them through, which isn't, you know, my vibe. And I like the way it was tied up at the back. It was a little bit different. And um, also, I'm just gonna be posing a little bit funny for you guys, if you are new here. Um, I share body positivity and just like feeling comfortable within your body and your own shape and just not just showing you guys like the best bits. So yeah, we can all, you know, pose, hold in, clench our stomach muscles, but at the same time, we can relax them. And my whole point of this is just to make you guys feel like worthy and know that in like you can just feel comfortable being relaxed in this in a bikini and even if you don't it's okay like you can work on it there's always ways to make yourself feel better so definitely like i mentioned earlier if you're not following me over on instagram come over there because i share lots of body positivity tips um ways to feel comfortable within your own skin and even like i it's something i've struggled with for such a long time and if you haven't seen my video of my journey i've actually got like a very a sit down chill vlog where I share with you guys my whole like sort of 10 year journey of basically like all the stuff that women go through and what exactly what I went through from about the age of 15 to about 25 um, and I kind of feel like I'm done with all that now, I'm 29 and I just actually am the happiest I've ever been within myself and within my body and I don't feel the need to hate on myself anymore because it's just not fun. So yeah, if you need some more of those positive vibes, come over up to Instagram, like I mentioned. Um, so then the bottoms are really cute as well. They're really just, again, they've just got really cute little frill. I love a white bikini. I think it's probably my favorite, white or pink, just super like easy and plain. I'm all about like quite plain style. I don't really love too much fuss, too much going on. I like a fruffle, a ruffle, a frill here and there, but I'm not like, I just think ones like this are classic. They're never gonna go out of style, my favorite kind of thing. But again, I think it's just such a shame. I feel like a large, would have been just a dream. Okay, so this next one, I don't know how this looks anything like it does on the model. I mean, it is the most unflattering shape on my figure I have ever tried on. And I've tried on a hell of a lot of bikinis in my time, okay? A hell of a lot. 
Um, I don't know how it's going up the model's bum so much. Like, I couldn't pull it up my butt if I tried anymore. I like the colour and I like the idea of this bikini, but again, I think it's just because the size is too small. It just didn't do me any favours. Like, honestly, didn't do anything for me. And again, like, the size in it is just so snug. It's barely any bigger than the small that I tried on. I just think the way it's like cut straight across, it just, and then it cuts across here, it makes my stomach look very blocky, very square. It's not the most flattering on at all, um, which is again such a shame because it had high potential. It's got adjustable straps. It's a very nicely made bikini, um, but I just don't think it's the most flattering. And then it's got a little silver clasp at the back. So, yeah, I don't really know what to say about that one. Again, not really off to a great start, are we? I don't really know how the model made it look that fantastic. You know, I I tried my best, but I'm sharing with you the reality of this. And the reality is, I always give you guys honest reviews and I just feel like if I didn't, what is the point? I don't want you guys buying something and then it just not look, like you just feel like, what is this? Because there's no point. So, okay, this one I really like. This is a, like, I feel like there's Ted Baker vibes. Um, this is really, really sweet swimsuit. And again, blue's not a colour I normally go for, but I just thought the print on this was really pretty. And I thought the back straps were really gorgeous as well. It's kind of booby, but again, I think it's making me look more busty because it's a medium. If I was in a large, I think it would have fit so much better. Um, however, I could get it on and it wasn't, you know, poking in too many places. So, you know, we can we could probably work with this one, but yeah, I really like the print and I really like the back. It's this nice and supported as well. Again, you can remove the straps and it has got this like really supported bit under the bust area, which I think is really nice. It felt felt very secure in it. Um, and I think it was very, very pretty. This is gonna give you guys a giggle. I finish, I promise we'll finish on a high. <laughs> I'm not normally negative Nancy, but I just wanna be honest because I am very optimistic, I'm very positive, but when things just don't fit right, they just don't fit right. And you you can't skirt around that, okay? So this is like the skimpiest bikini and it's so gorgeous and it'd be perfect for tanning in. I love the colors of this and I love the um, design of it. I think it's really, really gorgeous. Obviously, it would have fit me better in a large because I'm a size 12. Um, and I do like bikinis to be slightly bigger than too small because there's nothing worse than them just like poking in. Which, if you have seen the bottoms of this yet, you will notice the bottoms literally are almost slicing me in at the hip. Now I haven't got a huge amount of fat on my body. I can relax my stomach muscles, you know, we can all push our bellies out and look bloated, but I haven't got loads of fat, okay? And this honestly was like creating what I can only call as like a burger on my hip like the two two sides at the top are the bread rolls which is my skin and then this is like the burger inside the middle because honestly it just dug in like I don't even know what I have never worn bikini bottoms that dug in that bad um, and again I'm just like well that's not a UK size 12 so the style of that bikini I really love and obviously in a bigger size would have been fantastic However, we ain't got no big size. That's what I've got. So I'm giving you my feedback on these key knees. But we are gonna finish on a high. I do like the last one, however, I don't find it the most flattering. Um, the one which I think is gonna be the most flattering on everyone is definitely the swimsuit because I just think it's it's great for a small bust, it's gonna be great for bigger busts. It it holds everything in sort of like the right places. The back is very sexy. Um, but you're still sort of like a bit covered if you're ever belly conscious and I just think it's super flattering in that sense um, Yeah, so then the last one I've gone for like a yellow gingham frill bikini and now this is really cute The bottoms have got like this little ruching in on the bum which always like makes your bum like a little bit better um, And then it's got really cute little frills. I do kind of think this is like a kiddie bikini, but I love it for that reason um, And then the top is again super cute it's got a frill on the bottom but again I do feel like the squareness of it sort of like makes my torso look quite square um, so just bear that in mind if you're similar shape to me then it's got a really sweet crisscross back and adjustable straps again this one the fit was better but again 
the boobies. I just need a bit more space and I don't even have big boobies. So, you know, they're middle, they're middle of the road, they're average size. Uh, so yeah, I would love to hear if you guys like any of the bikinis. Let me know down below if you have a favorite. Um, and if you did enjoy this video today, please hit the subscribe button. Make sure you subscribe for all those good vibes. And if you need some body confidence or body positivity in your life, definitely come over to my Instagram as well as some daily fashion posts. Um, I also share lots of like sale finds and just like little little treats over there. Um, this is going to be my last summer haul that you guys will see here on my channel. So we're now officially in autumn. Actually, it's autumn today, the day I film this. So that is actually the last summer haul of 2020. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, just an honest review. Again, as always, I share reviews on Mondays. So make sure you are subscribed not to miss out. I also share a fashion haul um, on some styling videos every Sunday and then occasionally during the week on a Wednesday we have a little extra video of some sort. So if there's anything you guys want to see more of, I know you mentioned before you wanted to see some body positivity videos, maybe some self love videos. Um, I already do have a few of those. Um, I will leave them linked below this video or in the little eye icon so you can just click and watch them after this video. Thank you so much to Cupshe for sending me these bikinis and I hope you guys enjoyed my honest review. And like I mentioned, if you did love any of them and you were going to go and get them in your size, obviously, like I mentioned, go to the size large if you are a 12. Um, then use my discount code as well for, I think it's 10% off. I'll put it here anyway. And I'll hopefully see you in the next video. Thank you so much for being here. Have a lovely morning, afternoon or evening. Bye for now.